Hello everyone, welcome to Severe Weather Awareness Week. I'm Addison Thomas. And I am Ella Grace Johnson. This week my classmates and I are going to update you on the things you can do to stay safe during a, during severe weather. Today our classmates Cole and Cooper will soon tell you how to stay safe during thunderstorms. But first let us quickly explain what thunderstorm is. A typical thunderstorm is 15 miles in diameter and lasts an average of 30 minutes. Of the estimated 100,000 thunderstorms that happen each year in the U.S., about 10% are classified as severe. A severe thunderstorm produces hail at least one inch in diameter and has winds 50 miles per hour or stronger. We will go to Cole and Cooper now to explain how you can be safe during a severe thunderstorm. Thank you, Ella Grayson Addison. Good morning, everyone. I'm Cooper Grove. And I'm Cole Ellen Moore. There are several things that you can do to stay safe during a thunderstorm. One thing to remember is when thunder wars go indoors. If you are outside, move from the outdoors into a building or car. You should pay close attention to alerts and warnings. You need to unplug all of your appliances. And do not use landline phones. There's also several things you can do now to prepare for a thunderstorm. Know your area's risk for thunderstorms in most places. They can happen year-round at any hour. Create an emergency plan now so that you can, you and your family know what to do. Identify nearby sturdy buildings close to where you live, work, study, and play. Cut down or trim trees that may be in danger of falling on your home. Consider buying surge protectors, lightning rods, or a lightning protection system to protect your appliances and electronic devices. We will go back to Addison and Ella Grace now to finish our reports. When, when thunder roars, go indoors!